A group of scholars have gathered in Japan's Kyoto to criticize the country's concealing of wartime medical crimes. These crimes include those committed by Unit 731, the Japanese Army's Biological Warfare Division during World War II. Instead of being tried for war crimes, the researchers involved in Unit 731 were given immunity in exchange for their data on human experimentation. For a long time, the medical crimes have been kept secret by the Japanese government and medical circle. But recently, both the Ritsumeikan University in Kyoto and Kyushu University in Fukuoka have disclosed more vivid evidence relating to Japan's medical crimes during World War II. Many Japanese scholars worry that with the disclosure of more materials proving the medical crimes, Japan's efforts to whitewash the crimes will only put the country in a more passive situation. We think it's necessary for the Japanese government to recognize these facts. We have to push the government on this aspect. Nishiyama called on medical scientists to abide by medical ethics and pass this attitude on to the youth. Doctors and medical researchers are scientists as well. If they lack the attitude to face up to the history honestly, they can't be called scientists and researchers. Though there are many difficulties, we should work hard to overcome them.